Hi, in this video, you will learn the MQL4 coding lesson one. So in my teaching style, I will teach you slowly and make sure you have strong understanding on the programming fundamental. Although I know that at the end, you will not need to be a MQL4 programming master, but at least you know what you need to write and why you need to write before you really jump into the MQL4 coding. So spend a little bit of time to understand the fundamental of programming. So this video, I will teach you what is the program flow and how a program will flow and how MQL4 program flow is. So, Again, for a newbie like you to start the programming, there are few concepts that you must know. So the first is this program flow. Actually, it is just like a mathematic and it is very logical. If you are strong in mathematic and logical, then this will not be a problem for you. However, if you are weak in the logical thinking, then I guess you might think twice before you continue for the this video for MQL4 programming. Okay, what is a program flow? Program flow is the order of the program will be executed. So that is a commander in the programs, which is the MT4 itself. The commander will execute the task one by one. For example, the commander in the country will be the president. And the president will give order what to do first and what to do next. So the program flow is a flow what will be executed first and what will be executed next. In MT4, the commander will be the MT4 itself. So the MT4 will give control to the application that you have built, say the EA, the indicators, or the scripts. Then the question you might ask, how the program will flow? In fact, it is very simple. A program will flow just like a water stream. Water stream, water flow from a high stream to a lower stream. Same with programming. A program flow from a top task to the bottom task. There is no way that a water will flow from the bottom stream to the top stream. So just like a programming, there's no way that a program flow from the bottom task and then return back to the first task. Okay, let's look at the example, how the program will flow. So I have created this simple script and then I alert out. I just want to print out two alert dialog box. The first is to print out the hello world and the second is uh, I can code alert. And later on you will see that the program flow in such that it will show the alert. You execute this line first, line 19, and then only execute this line 20, which is I can code. So the program will flow from the top to the bottom. And uh, this is all the property that you can ignore for now. And uh, on start function, you will have ignore for now. This is for intermediate and I will explain in another video. But the important part is, you know that the program flow from the top to the bottom. And in this script, that will give you the output is this two function, which is called the alert. And this will show the alert message box. The first is the hello world and second is the I can code. So you will definitely will not see that this I can code will be shown first and then next will be this uh, hello world will be shown after the I, I can code. So it didn't do work that way. The program flow from the top to the bottom. All right, so I compile my code and then I go to this one and execute my script. Okay, so this is a pop-up pop 
So as you as you can see, the pop up, the first message will be the hello world. So since the hello world is the top messages or top task, then it will execute the first task, then followed by the second task. The second task is this I can code. Okay, so if let's say I execute once more. Okay, same behavior as well. So you can see that the hello world will be executed first and then followed by I can code. So in this video, you should know what is a program flow and how a program will flow and how MQL4 program flow is. So for more video tutorials, please visit mt4programmingcourse.com. If you find this video helps you, give me a like or do some comments and subscribe my video channel. Again, thank you for watching and happy learning.